this is like huge in some countries um <laughs> and basically this is just like a major major aphrodisiac for both men and women um you could literally like spike your partner's drink with this like <laughs> Damien, Damien has been like around for hundreds of years and even in history and folklore it's always known as you know basically like a love potion and so this is really fun um I've had Damiana for like a couple years now maybe one or two or two or three should I say and um it does work <laughs> it does work 100 percent um this is something that's good like um let's say you were maybe like on a hormonal birth control or you had something big happen to where you noticed that like your levels were kind of out of whack maybe your libido goes down because like that happens to a lot of people when they're having um when they sometimes if they get on like a birth control or if they're getting off of it and you know there's just different times where you might be normal and then you might be really low obviously this would just like help and Basically you would take like a dropper full, so that's 28 or 56 drops and just like count them out. You can put it directly in your mouth, it actually tastes good. Um, Damiana is, um, well this is, it says Damiana leaf, but I've also had the tea and so I guess it's just the dried leaves and it's a nice taste. Um, they also have capsules as well, but um, this is good stuff, I like this stuff. <laughs> I think you will too. Um, and then the last, this is like new new, it's Bora Cap. And so, um, I think uh, one of the my favorite uh, Instagram pages to follow because it's Nini's Fem Health. Like, she has amazing stuff, like amazing washes specifically for pH balancing, and um, little wipes because you know feminine wipes like obviously you don't want to smell like a baby wipe down there or something and so like these like don't have a scent like literally no scent because really you don't want like fake scents down there and yeah she just makes like really really solid stuff but a lot of the girls who follow her like they're always talking about her version of this now this isn't hers um this is just a different bora cap this is like a different brand that i got from amazon but basically it is a natural way to well, it says it promotes healthy vaginal pH but usually people use it if they um, have a yeast infection or if they have like a BV which is just uh, I think it's bacteria vaginosis um, and I didn't know that that was like reoccurring for some people and sometimes like they'll go to the doctor and basically the medications like won't wipe it out and so this is just like a boric acid and it's like a suppository and it sounds really scary but it, it's not trust me the stuff that you get like if you have a yeast infection like over the counter is probably more harsh than this is like it sounds scary but it doesn't like hurt or anything it's not crazy it doesn't have like a scent but it really really helps um your girl messed up i went swimming um at the beach and then basically i didn't bring a change of bottoms like i had on like this little dress cover up and then after that right after the beach went to a bar and i stayed at the bar for like gosh four or five hours like we were there till like it closed down and so um if you stay in wet swimsuit bottoms like i i tried to take them off but my dress was too short because it was just like a beach cover-up dress and so you would have been like i would have been sitting on you know gross chairs and yeah or have my, my butt hanging out and so anyways um i had to keep them on and yeah uh next day i was not feeling good you're not supposed to stay in wet baby suit bottoms i think everyone knows that and so you know i messed up <laughs> and i paid for it and so i finally so my battery died um but yeah i finally had a reason to try this after always seeing it for like ever and yeah i'll make a separate video on it so far it totally worked um like i said it's a lot more easy for me than using like a monostat thing um or something because sometimes like that kind of stuff like burns i don't know um and so i think as a natural way to get rid of something like that like i just felt like i had to share and so yeah if you've been looking at it too or hearing other people use it like i would say definitely try it if you have an issue with like a bv or reoccurring um yeast infections 